now. Thought I would fall for your traps, but I'm too smart for that. I am Wilder Gamer. Fear me. <laughs> Take that, you sons of bitches. Fear my flashlight of doom. <laughs> Stupid plants. Think they can kill me? Too smart for that shit. Oh, this is cool. Let's look for a couple more collectibles. This game is just freaking eerie. Pretty new to Twitch too. Don't know what that term is. Whoa, shit! I almost walked right into it. Whew. Calm down. You're fine. You're alive. You're on some weird alien planet. Oh, that scared the shit out of me. <laughs> Stupid fucking death dildo plants. I just saw your stream on Xbox. You're fucking awesome, man. Thank you, Nightwing. You are awesome, man. You're awesome. But I agree, I am pretty awesome. Lyric is the top Twitch broadcaster. Oh, cool. I have never heard of that dude. I will go search him right after we are done here. Maybe I can learn a couple things. Let's see here. Let's go over here. Oh, Death Canyon. Nope. Not gonna go to the Death Canyon. Gonna go over here. It's a big ass canyon. Can I like get up high and launch myself over there? There's a spot I might be able to get over. Or the uh, death dildo will make a path for me. Tickle, tickle, tickle! <laughs> Major squirt. <laughs> Silly freaking wooden death dildo. Get the fuck out of here. No science over here. Let's go see if we can do a science over here. Man, freaking weird ass plants on this planet. Oh shit. God, man. I'm really glad they added the flashlight in this game. It helps a lot when, uh. But you know, it also adds to that sense of just just being isolated we're just completely alone on this planet you know there, there's this overwhelming sense in this game of just dread and just being completely alone i mean the only character we've interacted with presumably killed our friend and then leapt to her presumed death i have no idea if she's alive i have no idea if she's still following me or stalking me, or whatever. She scares the hell out of me, though. Oh my god, what the fuck? Oh, good, Death Canyon. Holy shit. <laughs> you want to talk atmosphere and get this game? Shit. Um... Uh, What other games do you play, bro? I love to play with you. You seem like a chill guy. Thank you. Thank you, Nightwing. Um, I play everything. You name it, I have it. I've played it. Uh, I play... I don't really play a lot of PC games, but I have a couple of them. I got Kerbal Space Program. I got Papers, Please. I got uh, Prison Architect. That's about all my computer can really handle. Uh, on the X-Bone, I play absolutely everything. I play a lot of Grand Theft Auto V every night. If you guys ever want to jump in there, go ahead, follow my gamer tag. It's the same as my Twitch handle. And oh god, oh god, shit's following me. Let's get the hell out of here. Uh, like evolve or something? Yes, yes, I absolutely play evolve. Uh, haven't played it since launch though. I downloaded it, played it like three days in a row. Got kind of burnt out of it because uh, none of my friends were playing it. Oh god, shit's still coming after us. And then uh, I stopped playing it just because I couldn't get into a game with any of my friends. Good game, though. Really fun. You either have really, really, really fun matches that are really balanced and really, you know, thank you, wooden dildo. 
that are, uh, what was I saying, really balanced and really fun, or uh, you either have, ah, oh, son of a bitch, you either have shit matches that are just, the guy's overpowered, or you have terrible teammates who love to uh, split off and do, do their own thing. All right, let's get the hell through this thing. Life is Strange Episode 3 is coming out. I had no idea. I love that game. I will absolutely stream that game. Uh, Witcher 3, I'm definitely gonna, gonna stream that. Man, Life is Strange. I love that shit. That shit was so fucking trippy. Mortal Kombat. I have Titanfall. I have not played Mortal Kombat in years. I kind of want to get back into it. If there's a huge demand for me to play Mortal Kombat, I absolutely will. Alright, not going to go in the... Oh, God. Maybe I'm just going to walk into the other death plant that was right there. I want it to be daytime. I want to be back in the desert. Leave me alone, you stupid wooden dildos. Leave me alone. Seriously, bro. <laughs> I just want to do science. Leave me alone. <laughs> if you guys want more Wilder Gamer in your life, please follow me on Twitch, Twitter, and YouTube. Uh... Twitch and YouTube are, or Twitch, Twitter, and YouTube are all XX Wilder Gamer XX. And now these things are just shooting out of the wall to kill me. Oh God! These plants still hating on me, bro. Still absolutely hate me. On the death plant. There we go. Oh, shit. Hell yeah, I'll play with you, Nightwing. I'll play with you any night of the week, man. Any night you want, I'm there. What the fuck? What the hell was that? <laughs> Pretty sure I'm tripping balls. Be some kind of a trap. I don't like that. I don't like that thing. Go away. Go away, weird plant thing. I absolutely love Life is Strange. If you guys want me to stream that, I absolutely will. I will play that game a hundred thousand times. Whoa, shit, there's a freaking weird thing. Are you gonna attack me? Are you gonna be my friend? Come back. Oh, God, nope, not gonna be my friend. Doesn't want to be my friend at all. Fuck yeah, I made myself a friend. <laughs> Hell yeah, man. So the uh, the weird plant ash lady things kind of remind me of the uh, ash people in Gears of War 3. Are you going to pop back up? No? Okay, I'm going to go check out this plant thing then. That's, I thought there was a collectible over here. Does anyone out there have any gaming tattoos? And Life is Strange has a beautiful soundtrack. Absolutely. The soundtrack in that game is absolutely phenomenal. Okay, this is unsettling as hell. I'm completely alone. I have no weapons. Last stand. Last stand for what? Whoa, Aurora's. Cool. This is pretty sweet.
Right, everything agrees with you completely October. Rachel Amber's disappearance. Uh, well, we're only on episode two of, what is it, five, I think? Um, I don't trust Nathan at all. The principal. <laughs> Let's see, I definitely don't trust Nathan. I think his family is involved with it somehow. I don't know, man. I think it's too early to really tell... Uh, Tell what's going on in that game. Back to the alien homeworld, and the Russians were afraid of what might be on the other side. Okay, so they reverse engineered the portals to go back to the alien homeworld, and of course, that's a genius idea. Nothing could possibly go wrong from that, right? Due to the power fluctuations we first witnessed last winter, we have been unable to use the portal. After the accident, we decided to wait for a few weeks to see if the portal stabilized. It didn't. And in fact, it has now been months since we have been able to transport anyone through the portal. Then, just yesterday, as I mon monitored the device, I witnessed something both exhilarating and terrifying. Through the flickering light of the portal, I saw for the briefest moment a fantastic alien world with unbelievable architectural structures. It seems the portal creators have recalibrated the portal to a new destination, their home planet. We dare not attempt to travel through it now. I think the photography teacher, he just has a creepy vibe. Oh man, that game, you, you could, I could go on for hours dissecting that game. It is phenomenal. I, I really wasn't expecting such a good story from that game. It absolutely surprised me and slapped me in the face with one hell of a story. Science! Or collectible thing. Yearning for bread. They started handing us bread today. This was not a foreign concept to us, but it was something we all thought we left behind. Where are the supplies? Why haven't they sent us food? If we knew it would have been like this, we would have planted crops. Surely with all this plant life, we could have grown grain for bread. Man, if only they had hired some sort of... I don't know, smart people to go on this journey instead of freaking morons. You know, like the scientists we have at the International Space Station right now that uh, know shit. It's my birthday! Happy birthday, Coco Mods! Everyone in chat must wish uh, Coco Mods a happy birthday. That is awesome and so glad that I could bring you this game on your birthday. That is absolutely awesome. Thank you for spending it here with Wilder Gamer and all the Wilder Gamers here in the chat. That makes me feel real good, man. <laughs> that is so cool. Okay, so that just kind of leads out to a plateau. Can we... We might be able to jump that. Let's try and jump it. Do we have the, like, extendo... No! No, we don't! Uh-uh. Not gonna work. <laughs> Let's get the hell out of here. Jump. Let's uh let's explore this weird little little outpost a little bit more. Let's go over here. Whoop. Thought I could parkour that is that a person? There's my double jump. Yeah, I knew we needed that. Can I parkour these? Oh yeah I can. Bloop! Oh yeah, in the pipe. Parkoured the shit out of that pipe. Is there anything in here? Nope, nothing. No achievements, no nothing. Damn it, I did it again. <laughs> I accidentally flew into the second pipe again. <laughs> Derp. Can I get on top of this house?